feels like rendezvous You know what to do Keep your love for me only I get high on you Good morning guys, it is Tuesday. I'm just getting ready because I have to run some errands. Gotta go to like Rite Aid and boring stuff. I wanna go to Burlington Coat Factory. Like I can't stop thinking about it from last week. I really wanna go. So Henrik is off tomorrow. So it's Wednesday, hold on one sec. Okay, I just don't want you guys seeing like my saggy boobs. Um, but he is off tomorrow since it's Wednesday. So maybe we'll go to Burlington also. Let me look at my snap. One of you guys actually told me about Forever 21 Red. I just took a screenshot. Hold on. It was your snap is like banana, but I don't know. I don't know your real name, but her snap is banana. She let me know about Forever 21 Red and that they actually have a store here in Connecticut. For me, it's about 45 minutes, so I kind of want to go tomorrow, maybe, like, film a haul, like, get some stuff to film a haul, or, like, um, sorry, my face is so dry, or get, like, do a little inside the dressing room. Honestly, like, I don't know much about Forever 21 Red, and I tried to look at their website, and there's, like, nothing on there, so I'm really curious to see what they have. She said they have a great plus size section, so... I'm really, really curious. I really wanna go check that out. I feel like I've seen a few videos possibly about it and it's like a cheaper, she, well, Banana, I'm just gonna call you Banana because I don't know your true name, but um, she told me that it's like Forever 21's little sister with cheaper prices and Forever 21 already is pretty affordable, so that's amazing. So I'm so intrigued to like see what that's all about. So I kinda wanna go there tomorrow. Depending on like what Henrik wants to do, I don't know if, how he's feeling, like if he's tired, if he just wants to chill, if he wants to stay local, like I don't know what he wants to do. If he does want to just stay local, then I possibly I want to go to Burlington Coat Factory. I could go today, but it's already 1.30. And I don't know, I just like to do kind of that, that stuff like early in the morning. I don't know. I just want to like check it out because I haven't been in Burlington Coat Factory in years. And last time I went, like it wasn't that great. But now that I like have my own apartment, I'm curious to see if they have like good home decor stuff or like, you know, just like little things like throw pillows or blankets or just something. I'm also looking for like a basket to keep my blankets in, extra blankets for the living room. So, and just like looking for little pieces to complete the apartment. Like, I need a lot more stuff in my bedroom and I need a lot more stuff for this room because you guys know that I'm redoing it. Hopefully that happens sometime soon. Um, I just want to address last night's vlog really quickly because I'm, I'm reading your comments and a lot of you guys are saying that like I sound sad or like yada yada yada. I'm not, I wasn't sad at all. <laughs> I was just talking really quietly because Henrik was sleeping and I didn't want to disturb him because it was like maybe like 1.30 in the morning. I didn't want to wake him up because he had to be at work early. But no, I'm not sad. Nothing bad's happening. Like, it's actually just crazy news. So, like, I don't know. Crazy stuff's been going on. <laughs> but crazy in a good way. I just don't want to share it yet. So, anyways. But that's what's going on. So, I've been a little bit distracted. Got a lot of stuff going on in my personal life. Nothing's bad, though. Like, everything's going great just crazy stuff i'm gonna stop that because it's probably so annoying because i'm like not telling you what it is so anyways i'm putting my makeup on just to run a few errands just because i feel like when you get ready you just feel better throughout the day you're more motivated to do things like i don't know i'm probably gonna take charlie for a little walk because it's really nice out it's like i believe it's 53 degrees today and it's sunny Spring is right around the corner. I can taste it. Oh my god. I need it. I Need spring so bad. Okay, now that I've been blabbing for a good five minutes. I'm gonna let you go <laughs> And I'll bring you along my little adventure today. I Don't know what I'm gonna do. I I, I just want to get out of the house like I have to go to Rite Aid Which is boring as hell. I probably won't vlog in there because it's just like super quick and then last night I was in Trader Joe's for a little while and I haven't been in Trader Joe's in years. 
and I was looking for zucchini pasta because I heard it's really really good and it tastes just like pasta so I was like curious to try it but they said that it was a seasonal item and that they didn't have it right now so I'm wondering if maybe Whole Foods will have it maybe we'll take a ride to Whole Foods we'll see what we do today <laughs> I'll probably end up doing not a lot I'll be like oh yeah we're running so many errands and then I'll get out and I'll be like mmm never mind I ordered some stuff from Amazon I ordered I got pee, -pee pads because <laughs> I need a few more I ordered this little like hold on this little fake fit Fitbit thing from Amazon it had like four and a half stars and over 800 reviews or something like that and I just am curious to know how many steps I walk a day because like my phone's not on me at all times it's like if I'm cleaning the house or like you know doing errands or something it's usually either in my purse or I sit on the table or on the counter like I'm not attached to my phone so it's not an accurate step counter so I'm just curious and it was really affordable I think it was like $30 um, on Amazon so I'm curious to see what that's like it also has like a sleep pattern tracker and like a what else I don't know like you can get your texts and calls and stuff to it it's basically like in between an Apple watch and a Fitbit probably but literally $30 so we'll see if it like works or is trash <laughs> I also think you can get your heart rate on it Basically everything like a fitness watch does and I don't really like wearing them because I think they're pretty ugly, but I'm just curious That's also why I don't want to like spend a lot of money on getting like an Apple watch or a Fitbit because I don't think they're cute And I'm not someone that's gonna like wear that all the time, you know Just that I'm like curious to know Okay, okay guys, I just put my makeup on I wasn't gonna throw a lash on and then I was like, eh, why not? So I put a little natural lash on it's supernatural these are the coco lashes in i can't remember because i threw it away mm. sorry can't remember but it's one of the like really wispy looking ones they're pretty long just like very wispy and pretty my lip combo this is what i was wearing in the rude 21 video that i think i got a couple questions on um it is where's my lip liner oh it is all by nyx it is the nyx lip liner in the color nude beige she just looks like this it's pretty brown and then i have the nyx lingerie lipstick on in the color lace detail which looks like this i got these little minis in um an advent calendar last year so yep all right i'm gonna get dressed really quick and then hit the road okay guys i have not updated you in forever because i left my camera down here in the car but it's now seven o'clock i put on a better lash because that lash was looking like shit <laughs> um i'm with kate hey i have to go pick up my packages I told you guys I ordered that little like Fitbit thing. So I'm gonna go test it out. But yeah, and then we're gonna go run some errands. Unfortunately, I cannot bring you along too. <laughs> um, and then dun, dun, dun. I'll see you later when I make dinner. So what's today? Today is Dominican Independence Day. <laughs> and? And you know, Viva la Revolucion. Wait, what was it? Viva la Revolucion. What? Viva la Revolucion. One more time. La Independencia. So to all my Dominicans out there, shout out. Get real, please. I'm trying to zoom in on the Yumi. Yumi. It's so rough. It's so rough. Fine. Wow, thank you. Uh, to all my Dominicans out there, you know, have fun, eat a lot of plantains. Please hold. <laughs> Proceed. <laughs> Proceed. Eat a lot of plantains. <laughs> Dance a lot of salsa. Ooh. I miss my brother. Yourself. Ooh. Tu sabes. tranquilo, vive rápido. Tu sabes. Disfruta la, disfruta la vida. Está bueno. The fruit of your life? <sighs> just with some white milk. Didn't just, you just say the fruit of your life? <laughs> la fruta de la vida. No, disfruta tu vida. De fruta. Yeah. De vida. Yeah. The fruit of your life? No, not the fruit of your life. Uh, Is this the fruit of your loom? No. Haynes commercial? Jesus. <laughs> it's like, you know, enjoy your life. And, you know. I'm um, pretty sure you said fruit. <sighs> fruta? See what I have to deal with, guys? La fruta. No, the fruta. 
Y así, disfruta. Disfruta la vida. Sounds so sexy when you speak Spanish. Gracias. De fruta. Disfruta la vida. Right, so, so, the fruit. No, it's not the fruit. Stop acting like you know what I'm talking about. How do you say fruit in, in Spanish? Frutas. Okay, exactly. But, it, that, but that's not what I'm saying. Point proven. Thank you. Uh, okay. De fruta de vida. No. The fruit yeah. of your life. No. That's not <laughs> what I'm trying to say. Thank you for hijacking this. I appreciate you. Just enjoy yourselves, guys. Peace and blessings. Go ahead. Go ahead, tell them uno no, más, no, no. uno más tiempo no, en inglés. Go know, ahead, no, 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 uno más tiempo en español. Tú sabes, sí, pero tú sabes, sí, tú sabes, uh, sí. dígalo. Claro que sí. Please tell, tell them more. Tell them more about your fucking 90 second rice, huh? <laughs> tell them about it. Go ahead. Boil that shit more. Go, dale. Dale qué? I already said my piece. Dale. You already disrespected the people enough. They're so stupid. Say it again. Okay. Say what you want to say to, to your Dominican people. No, que disfruta la vida. Viva la independencia. Tell me about independence. Yeah. And it's, uh, it's, I'm happy, I'm proud to be Dominican. It's a great time. I had Dominican food this weekend. It was great. And, uh, you know, I gotta go back to the motherland soon. The motherland! The mothership. Look, uh, I'm holding the camera right now. Yeah, I know. I see it's very... Uh, I'm ho horrified about this angle that's happening right now. You know, no, you look cute. Look. Here and, we go. Uh, Wait, mira. Okay, good. Ah! And uh, it's, uh, the most thing I'm proud of is being Dominican, so. I thought that you're the most thing you're proud of was me. Okay, was it? sure. We'll just make you number one. For <laughs> Can you let the, the Dominican people live for a little bit? We've only been invaded by everybody. I'm from the French side, as you can't tell, since I'm blanco like a vaso de leche, you know? Yeah, exactly. Un vaso de leche. It's, uh, listen, Coño. It's, 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 call me flower, baby. So, uh, yeah. It's been Stop making love to the camp, fam. What do you mean? You're, okay. you're making I'm love. Done. Thank you. You're making love. <laughs> you look so hot, though, but you're so pissy. Thank you. So cranky. Finish your statement. Go ahead. I did. You, you, oh, you, you, you always constantly you're, interrupt. Wait, so I don't put your head time. down. Uno mas. Uno mas que? Uno mas. I, I really hope you're enjoy fucking editing all this shit. Uh, this is all going in. Okay. There's no editing. Your, your, your constant mistakes and rudeness. And there's no cuts. The I just said cunts. <laughs> I just said there's no cuts. Yeah, exactly. See? In disrespect of the country mm -hmm. that I'm from. Not just in the our country. Our children are going to be from. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. exactly. Okay. Live life, enjoy yourself, dance, you know, dance some salsa, merengue music, eat some plantains, and pernil, and tostones, and longaniza, and clearly that. And empanadas. Gabriella, no! <laughs> yes, we eat that, but that's not our staple. It's called quipes. Okay, and tostones? Tostones. Mm. Y queso blanco. Frito. No, no, queso frito. Yes. But, pero? Pero que. What about you, dog? It's, it's queso blanco. That gets it's fried. queso blanco, that, yeah, tropical. Mm -hmm. yeah, see, I know. I bought it for you once. I know. Okay. It's been a hot minute. So. Say good night. Good night, guys. Long live the Dominican Republic. Long live the queso frito. You guys, it is the end of the night. I wanted to tell you about this little fit band I got. I got it off Amazon. Let me show you. It looks just like a. Ooh, it looks just like a Fitbit. I haven't like you know fixed the time or anything, but. I also just put it on, that's why it says 300 steps, but it's pretty cool. It can track your heartbeat, how many calories you burn, your sleep patterns. Um, it has a timer. You can get your texts and calls on it. It's like in between an Apple Watch and a um, Fitbit. I have to read the directions more, but. But I got a package and I wanted to open it for you on camera. <laughs> um, I can't find the bottom piece to my tripod. I just took it off and I can't find it, so. I don't know, but I'm going to open this the best I can. It's from Bethany, right? Yeah, Bethany from Tonawanda, New York. I'm so excited. Thank you so much. I have to put the camera down to open it. Hold on. Oh, oh my God. These are my fave. These are my favorite candies. Sour Patch Watermelon. Thank you so much. Oh my god. Oh, Sour Patch Bunnies. I love Sour Patch. Thank you so much. You're so cute. 
Oh my god, you got me this? This is so cute. Contents, my life. Literally me. I think there's something in there. Oh, I'm gonna start crying. I am so emotional these days. Oh my god. One sec. Let me put this down again. <gasps> you found this? Bosha Cool Blue. This is my favorite. Girl. I must read the letter. Okay, she says at the bottom, I can read it on camera. Okay, she says, Gabriella, sending a little sunshine your way. I love you and watching all your videos. Your family, Henrik, and your dogs are also beautiful. I appreciate the time you take to put your videos out there for all the viewers like me. I love watching and I don't comment often, but wanted you to know I'm thankful for all that you do. I ran out of room, haha. <laughs> I saw that you were in need of another Bosha Cool Blue Hydration Essence and I wanted to send it your way. I bought it as a backup. Never ended up using it but I, when I switched to my skincare, but I lost the box. Thank you so much. That was so sweet. Hope you enjoy. Thanks again. Love, Bethany. Thank you so much. I love this. And mine's almost all out and I couldn't find it. TJ Maxx. You're so sweet. Thank you so much. I'm so happy it made the trip. Not that New York is very far, but you know, the mail room and stuff. Thank you so much. That was really, really sweet. And these candies, oh my God, I love. <laughs> You're so awesome. Thank you so much. <sighs> cards like that, not even just the gifts, but like just cards and like great comments and like Instagrams and Snapchats and Stuff like that reminds me of like the reason why I do this and why I talk to you guys every day and why I put myself out there <sighs> amongst like all the hate and all the bullshit that I get. Like comments like that and cards like that truly like lift my spirits and remind me why I'm here, like what my purpose is with my videos. And thank you so much. You're so amazing. Honestly, I love you guys all so, so much. You're the best, but I think this vlog was short today. Here's what I wanted to ask you guys. Are you guys enjoying the daily vlogs? Like, you know, the five days a week vlogs, or would you prefer me only vlogging when I'm doing something interesting? Like, is this getting a little bit boring? Is it getting a little bit like same thing every day, monotonous kind of thing, or are you guys enjoying it and you like it and yada, yada, yada. You tell me what you want because I personally, like I love watching people daily vlogs like I love it even if it's the same thing every day just because like you fall in love with the person's personality and you just want to watch whatever they're putting out so let me know if that's how you feel or if you guys would rather me just vlog on like fun days or like date days or just like things where I'm doing things and not just like in the house or cooking or you know da daily house tasks um but yeah I love you all so, so much. Tomorrow, Henrik has a day off. I'm going to get my nail fixed. I never actually showed you guys my nails, I don't think. Let me turn the brightness down. Okay, you can see better. So I have baby pink, and then this one right here. Let me see. They're baby pink. Why isn't this camera focusing? Baby pink, and then my ring finger is marbled, which she did by hand. And then I have a charm on there, which it's not really focusing. Come on, camera. There you go. I think you can see now. They're so beautiful. Oh, yeah, and then my thumb has two little horizontal gold stripes. I love them. They're so gorgeous. They're so girly. I love them. But this guy broke off. It's the same one that gave me a hard time last week, but I don't know, it just wasn't on there right. So I'm gonna go tomorrow to get that fixed. My appointment's at 10 a.m., so I'm out of here by 9.30. Nice early start for the day, and then I'm hoping to drag Henrik along <laughs> to either Burlington Co. Factory or to Forever 21 Red in Meriden. But I think he has a doctor's appointment at 2.30, so I don't know if Meriden will work, but we'll see what happens tomorrow. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.